gaza.com patriot powered by amity university viewers i'm somewhere deep inside in the jungles of nagaland with a bunch of troops who are from all the northeastern states the news that we hear about the northeast is mainly negative news we hear about violence we hear about the violence between the nagas and the manipuris but there is one place where the mizo can sit down with the khasi for a meal there is one place where the naga can call the manipuri his brother i am major goravarya and i am with the assam rifles the spot where we want to rest a little while have some tea have some cha as they say we was the average age of these assam rifle guys here who are with me is 26 28 and they're super fit i'm 20 years older than them i shouldn't be doing this but i am anyway time for tea for one number two three four sar aadmi idhar aap जी आपका नाम क्या है मेरा नाम ऑर्डर एल कांसो मेजर गौरव आर्या आपसे मिलकर बड़ी खुशी हुई आप कहाँ के रहने वाले मैं मणिपुर उखोर डिस्ट्रिक्ट के अच्छा एक बात बताइए गुरु जी जो चाय यहाँ पे बना रहे हैं आप लोग इसमें तेज पत्ती वगैरह सब कुछ चाय पत्ती सब डाल के चाय तो आपने फिट कर दी है ऐसी चाय कितनी बार बना चुके हैं आप ऐसा महफूज में कई बार बना चुके हैं जंगल में हम लोग बहुत बार हो चुका है ऐसा अच्छा और ये चाय पीने का मजा अलग है बहुत टेस्टी लगता है इसमें ये यहाँ पे और टेस्टी लगता है ना अच्छा बीच जंगल के बीच में जंगल में हाँ मिलो मिल कुछ भी नहीं है जंगल ही जंगल है बस जंगल और जंगल है इधर बहुत टेस्टी और अच्छा टेस्टी आता है इधर जंगल में अच्छा एक बात बताओ गुरु जी अब मैं आपसे ये पूछना चाहता हूँ ये हमने ना यहाँ पे हम लोग पेट्रोल पे आए आपने अपने आपने डिफेंस ले लिया अच्छा ऐसा भी कभी हुआ है आपकी नॉलेज में या आपके एक्सपीरियंस में कभी पहले कि आप लोग रेस्ट कर रहे हैं और वहाँ से कोई इंसर्जेंट आ गया कोई मिलिटेंट आ गया ऐसा होता है कभी हो चुका है सब हमारा कार्रवाई ऐसी इसलिए हम लोग पहले बार पे हो इसलिए हम लोग ये डिप्लॉय कर गए हम लोग चाय बनाने वालों का अलग शॉर्ट एड्रेस अच्छा तो सर चारों तरफ से हमारे प्रोटेक्शन है चारों तरफ प्रोटेक्शन लगा रखा है सर हाँ और एके फोर्टी सेवन लेके हाँ सर सारे जवान तैयार हैं और हम लोगों की बन रही है चाय व्यूअर्स वी आर हैविंग टी आई हैव नेवर हैड टी दे पुट तेज पत्ता विच आई हैवर सीन बिंग पुटेंट टी बट लेट्स सी आउट फिगर्स और ये लकड़ी को छील के इसका हमने एक चम्मच बना दी है ऐसे आप लोग खाना भी बना लेते खाना भी बना लेते सर चलते चलते ऐसे चलते चलते बनाना पड़ता है सर हम लोग गए थोड़ा मौका मिली तो बना ले रहे सर अच्छा इसके अंदर क्या क्या डाला है तेज पत्ता डाला है चीनी डाला है चाय पत्ती डाली है हाँ अच्छे से और पा, पानी है दूध है पानी है दूध है अच्छा व्यूअर्स यू नो असैम टी इज वर्ल्ड फेमस बट आई एम टोल्ड दैट टी विथ असैम राइफल्स इज स्टिल मोर फेमस आज पी के देखते हैं असैम राइफल्स की चाय दोस्त और क्या क्या बनाते हैं आप लोग आपने जैसे ये चाय अभी बना दी तो जब पेट्रोल में होते हैं तब तो कभी कभी तो जैसे सर्वाइवल के लिए और सांप वाप ये सब तो ठीक है पर उसके अलावा जो नॉर्मल खाना जो बना सकते हैं वो बना लेते हैं आप लोग कभी कभी हम लोग दाल चावल बना लेते हैं बीच में दाल चावल भी बना लेते हैं जैसे हम लोग जंगल में चलने के टाइम में ड्यूटी चलने के टाइम में हाँ जो सामान भूक नहीं सकता तो टाइल दाल लेकर दाल में डालने वाला है जैसे पत्ता जंगल पत्ता मिक्स करके हम लोग बना कर खा लेते हैं जंगल का पत्ता हाँ चावल में डाल के दाल दाल में डाल के सर तो उसे पेट भर जाता है भर 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 जाता है सर अच्छा अच्छे ट्रिप से दे मेड दिस टी आफ्टर मेकिंग दिस टी दे आर गोइंग टू रिमूव ऑल ट्रेसेस ऑफ दिस फायर यहां पे किसी को पता नहीं लगना चाहिए कि असम राइफल्स का पेट्रोल आया था अब पता भी नहीं चलना चाहिए सर और जैसे इधर हम लोग आप छोड़ के चले जाएंगे तो जंगल में आप फिर जाएंगे तो हम लोग को इसी पे मालूम हो जाएगा इसलिए 
ये बचाना पड़ता है सर हम लोग को और अगर कोई मिलिटेंट आता है इंसर्जेंट आता है हाँ। तो उसको भी पता लग जाएगा ये उन लोगों को भी पता चल जाएगा हाँ तो इसलिए आप लोग इसलिए चलते कार्रवाई करके हम लोग मिटा कर चले जाते यहाँ पे किसी को पता नहीं लगना चाहिए कि यहाँ पे हमने कभी आग जलाई थी या यहाँ पे कभी एसाम राइफल्स का पेट्रोल आया था फ्रेंड्स फैंटास्टिक टी तेजपत्ता टी लीव्स शुगर मिल्क वाटर ऑल गेटिंग टुगेदर हियर इन द मिडल ऑफ द जंगल यू नो दिस टी इज ऑल्सो इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज वी हैव our friends here our friends from the assam rifles who are uh, all over giving us protection because this area is deemed dangerous it's an insurgency prone area and we are here in the middle of nagaland and uh, we are having this tea you know friends we uh, talk about english breakfast tea we talk about darjeeling tea all of them are fantastic but to my mind the best tea i've ever had is assam tea made by the assam rifles in the jungles of nagaland Youngsters are now climbing the ladder. They're going to climb all the way up, and then they're going to come down. See, look at them go. Look at them go. Like young cheetahs. They're climbing. They're climbing. Look at them. And the ustads, their instructors are egging them on. You know, they are saying, "Or speed, cheek, speed," because actually they are training to overcome natural obstacles and rush towards the enemy. So yeah, the third the double dig, double dig. Go 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 go. This is the monkey swing. Monkey swing. Yes. Commando. Yeah 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 yeah. Come on come on. This is the balancing beam. They are on the balancing beam. They are on the balancing beam, and now first guy is already through. Commando! Amazing balance. Commando! Amazing balance. Commando! 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 Normally come in the excellent group, and the other guy. Commando! Hardly 20, 25 seconds. Commando! Commando! 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Commando! and they are through and they are through there they go you was you are about to see the dhava or the final fighting with the bennet when you attack an enemy objective usually the firing is when you use your weapons you using small arms you're fighting but when you have reached the objective when you are at the enemy defenses that is the time when there is hand to hand fight that is the time when you take out your rifles with your bayonets and then the bayonet fighting starts this is a live demonstration of how the bayonet fighting will be in times of war this is the famous dhava ustad shuru kare bowl the enemy has put his bayonet inside the enemy's stomach taken out his intestines
viewers you know to many of you it may seem play acting but this is not play acting this is very real this is exactly what the indian army did in kargil and all the battles this is what all soldiers do take the bayonet go up close and personal and disembowel the enemy shove the bayonet inside the enemy's chest or the enemy's stomach this is the final act of fighting when you overthrow the enemy and you are at his defenses where the fighting is at its worst <laughs> We was up here in the northeast somewhere in Nagaland and around me there are jungles beautiful bountiful jungles this beautiful jungle is also home to some of the most fierce insurgents who lurk here sometimes fighting for money and sometimes about some old notion of tribal honor and ethnic superiority but we need men and women tough men and women with weapons in their hands to guard India's northeastern frontiers and which is why I'm here to visit the officers and men of the famous the legendary Assam Rifles I have with me here six officers whom I'm going to speak with each with a very different story there are some officers who were born and bred in the Assam Rifles who have risen from within to take that coveted officer rank and lead men from front yet there are many others who have come in deputation from the Indian army let's speak to each one of them and let's find out what their stories are and i promise you viewers these are going to be very very interesting stories deputy commander k r chohan sir jain sir jain jain such a pleasure to meet you acha aap bataiye aap you are in assam rifles for how long kitna time ho gaya aapko assam rifles mein sir uh, i joined uh, assam rifle as a operator in signal sir okay. in 1992 sir acha acha yes sir aur uske baad fir then you picked up officer rank uh, sir uh, in 2009 i uh, i commissioned in assam rifles sir okay as a air cutter officer sir okay uh, in the rank of असिस्टेंट कमांडर सर अच्छा असिस्टेंट कमांडर तो आपको कितना साल हो गया टोटल गिनती में टोटल ट्वेंटी सेवन ईयर सर सत्ताईस साल हो गए ये सर सत्ताईस साल में कितना एक्शन देखा आपने सर बहुत अप्स एंड डाउन देखे सर हम असम रिफिल में मैंने सिंस आई फ्रॉम मैंने वो एज ए जवान भी देखिए क्या क्या जो वहाँ पर तकलीफ होती है क्या मुश्किल होती है एंड इट्स अ लॉट ऑफ हार्ड वर्क सर कि असम रिफिल में एज ए कमीशन लेना सर हाँ लॉट ऑफ हार्ड वर्क लॉट ऑफ सेक्रीफाइस हो सेक्रीफाइस सर लॉट ऑफ सेक्रीफाइस सर क्योंकि दो दो साल तक सर छुट्टी भी नहीं काटी सर हमने टू गेट दिस रैंक सर टू कम टू अप दिस लेवल्स और ये बात अगर मैं किसी और को समझाऊँ तो समझ नहीं पाएगा क्योंकि कितना इसमें बलिदान चाहिए ये सब पाने के लिए कितनी मेहनत करी है अच्छा और बताइए एक्शन क्या क्या देखा कभी इंसर्जेंट्स के साथ मिलिटेंट्स के साथ टेरिस्ट के साथ सर मुठभेड़ हुई ये सर मुठभेड़ हुई सर बट जे एंड के में ऑल्सो जे एंड के में जब थे वहाँ पर भी काफ़ी इंसर्जेंसी थी उस टाइम में जब भी बाहर जाना तो ये वापस आएंगे कि नहीं आएंगे ये नहीं होता था निर्धारित बहुत वहाँ भी इनकाउंटर देखे सर बट बाई द ग्रेस ऑफ गॉड कुछ नहीं हुआ बहुत सक्सेसफुली वहाँ पर भी एज ए ऑफिसर सर या नॉर्थ ईस्ट में भी आई वॉज इन जो बिफोर कमिंग हेयर सर जोने वोटो डिस्ट्रिक्ट में मैं पोस्टिंग था फाइव एस हमारी फल्स के साथ सर वहाँ पर एक्चुअली नागालैंड की एट्टी परसेंट ऑफ इंसर्जेंसी जोने वोटो से कहती है सर एटी परसेंट ऑफ इंसर्जेंसी इज फ्रॉम जोने वोटो तो सीज फायर ऑब्रोगेशन के बाद सर मैंने एज ए कंपनी कमांडर वहाँ पर 23 थ्री मिलीटेंट्स को अंडरग्राउंड्स को सर अप्रिहेंड किया है अच्छा। जिसमें दो बहुत टॉप लेवल के थे एक तो उनका फाइनेंस सेक्रेटरी था एन एन सी एन के का अच्छा इट वाज़ द फर्स्ट कैच आफ्टर एब्रोगेशन ऑफ सीज फायर सर और वो के सर एन को हैंड ओवर किया था हमने डिप्टी कमांडर के चौहान पेट्रियट में आने का बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर बींग पार्ट ऑफ आर शो थैंक यू सो मच सच प्लेजर मीटिंग एंड मेजर राहुल बर्तवाल जैन सर जय हिंद जय हिंद ब्रदर जय हिंद सो राहुल सर यू आर ऑफ कोर्स यू आर वेरिंग दी शोल्डर फ्लैशेज ऑफ दी एसम राइफल्स बट अदरवाइज फ्रॉम विच यूनिट आई यू सर आई एम फ्रॉम सिक्सटीन राजपुताना राइफल्स सर सिक्सटीन राजरफ यस सर वेरी गुड यार सो आई सी हाईल्टी Yes, sir. Priority कहाँ पे करी थी? Sir, we were at Lumpur, sir, in 2011 when I was commissioned. Okay. That time, uh, my unit Lumpur में थी. अच्छा. We served there till 2013 June, sir. Okay. So we were uh, in one of the important post. Uh, I I I was in one of the important post. Yes. That was known as Bhavani post and Achha. Hatunga post. Okay. And uh, that has got very much importance in for the 90 uh, when it uh, 1962 war. Okay. That Thagla Ridge. Okay. So we used to cover that. That post was there and the battalion area was there. So that was the terribly cold. Terribly cold, sir. During uh, winters. Yes, sir. It was minus. Uh, minus and uh, rest of the time it was most of time in the in the, in the summer it was raining. 
Yes. So the area was very bad. बहुत चलना भी बड़ा मुश्किल होता था एंड वहाँ पे हम लोग एलर्टीज करते थे दो दो तीन तीन दिन का तो ये बहुत ही अच्छा एक नया एक्सपीरियंस था सर फौज में आने का एंड Excellent. You came into the SM Rifles, sir. And how much time have you spent here? Sir, I am uh, completing two years here. Okay. As a uh, officer here. Yes. I came in the month of April 2016. All right. Initially, I was I got posted to one of the battalions. Yes. And after a stint of six to seven months, yes, I came back to SAM Rifle Training Center. Okay. So I was. Uh, I so you are part here. of the training uh, yes, sir. team. Yes, we, we are. I am a battalion training officer of number two training battalion. Okay. And uh, we are looking after the training of recruits as of now, sir. Okay. So tell me, uh, what was your experience in the unit? Yeah, Sam Rifles Battalion. So unit, the experience is totally different. Okay. Because as an infantarian, up वहाँ पे you are uh, you are again going with the same flow, same uh, ROPs कर रहे हैं आप and उनके साथ घूमना फिरना हो रहा है तो एक अलग से experience है. Sam Rifles troops, they are excellent, sir. Yes. They are actually excellent because uh, tough guys, sir. Huh? Tough guys, sir. आप किसी भी terrain में because they are here from last so many years. Yes. This force has a glory of 170 years of uh, sacrifice and history and of glory and sacrifice. Sir. Yes. And uh, to th these people are there working from last so many years and the same mode of thing they are following, sir. ROPs, ROPs and ROPs, CI, CI, CI. So it's a different learning experience first of all, sir. Then in SAM rifle and especially in units. You got to speak to people, sir. आप अलग-अलग tribes, अलग-अलग culture से मिलना मुलाकात होती है, तो that is again a learning. So you have Nagas, you have Mizos, you have Khasis, you have Kukis, everybody. Yes. Samas, yes. Aos, तो आप लोग कोनियाक, ये कोनियाक्स, तो every tribe has got different way of living life. Yes. And it's again a learning and knowledge, sir. And one good thing that you told me, you know, ROP, ROP, and ROP again and again. So. Obviously, since it's based on the infantry pattern, yes, and you are there in the jungle, sir. so every day you become an expert in minor tactics. Absolutely, sir. Why ambush, why raid, why patrolling, why sir. Uh, sir. you know ROP duty. Same Absolutely, thing again sir. and again Absolutely, and again, sir. right? And the learning experience is also there, sir. Obviously, you, obviously, you obviously learn yes. from your troops, you learn from your JCOs, yes. you learn from, learn from your uh, officers. Yes. So they uh, people who have already served here, their ex servicemen here, they used to come to our post, they used to share their own experiences. Yes. So that is again uh, a good learning, sir. That's always fun, no? Speaking Absolutely, to sir. speaking to old veterans who will come and Absolutely, talk to you. Because in our time, pe aisa hota tha, you know? sir, they'll tell sir, you those stories. Sir, sir. That's so much of fun. Thank you, Major Rahul. Jain, sir. And Jain, then uh, thank you for being on Patriot. Sir. Pleasure. Sir. Captain Archana sir. Chauhan. Sir. Welcome to Patriot. Thank you so much, sir. Okay. So, Captain Archana, tell me, you have been here for how long? Sir, I've been here for 18 months, sir. 18 months? One sir. and a half years, okay? Sir. And the, and the tenure is for three years, is it? So two to two and a half years, sir. Two to two, two and a half years. Sir. So you've gone through, I think, more than fifty percent of your tenure. Sir, it's over. And you're from which uh, regiment and which army? Sir, I belong to one four six light AD regiment SP, sir. Okay, okay, okay. AD. How different it is, tell me, because AD the culture is different. Sir. A lot of techos in AD, huh? Sir. And it's all about being a techo in AD. It's it's a lot of technical stuff in AD. Sir. Air defence. Here it's hardcore infantry work. Sir. How is it different for you? Sir, the difference is. Very much like for an AD, we are dealing with missiles and radars. It's a technical arm. Yes. Now coming to Assam rifles, the exposure has been completely different. Yes. Now here we are dealing with conventional ops of war. Yes. Intensive CI environment. Yes. So that exposure shifting from a peace location coming to a field. Yes. Was a very good learning experience also. Yes. And a new exposure to something to do good in life, sir. Yes. So uh, the differences must have also been in uh, the sheer physicality of the job because uh, there, you know. More brain is required in AD. Brain sir. is also required here. Sir. I'm not saying brain is not required here, but here it's also about you know because this is this is more aligned to the infantry, sir. right? So I'm sure the exposure must have been different. Sir. So what is your role here? What do you do? Sir, I've been posted as a training officer for the Mahila companies, sir, and additionally I'm doing the responsibility of the quartermaster also, sir. Okay. So we are training the Mahila recruits here, sir. These uh, Mahila recruits they come from all over or specifically northeast? No, sir, they're from the all over the country, sir. All over the country, sir. Kaisa lag raha hai? You must have found so many stories, huh? Sir. Where people have come because generally in our country, sir. You know, uh, many people would have told, especially in the villages, that women should not do this, women should not do that. Sir. But all of them are winners. I mean, they have. You know, fought against convention and sir. they've come here. So sir. you must have seen so many of such examples there. Sir, I'll give you a personal example, sir. I belong to a Ghazibad, a small village in Ghazibad. Everyone used to question my father, ki why you're investing so much on the study of a girl, sir. Okay. My father used to tell them, ki my daughter will prove her worth. Yes. And the first success that I achieved in my life when I saw my father, he was pipping my shoulder, sir. A oh, smile right. on his face said okay. it all, sir. No, I, sir. and that is worth 
So that is what all the smile, gold in the world. Sir, that yeah. smile on his face when he was pipping me, sir. Yes. It was the first success yes. that I have achieved in so my life. So what sir. happened to all those guys in the village who were saying that? The daughter has made us proud, sir. Now there is a change in uh, attitude. The, yes, sir. You need one success story, yes, sir. One success story, sir. Everyone's mood changes. Yes, sir. So. Tell me, have you tried to replicate a little bit of what you are here? Yes, sir. We have, sir. Sir, training a recruit is both a physically and psychologically investing procedure, sir. Yes. You need to make them physically fit also and yes. psychologically active to adhere to the rules and procedure of the force. Okay. They have to adjust themselves. See how, what role they'll be be used in the force, sir. Yes. So that is why, sir. Yes, the training standards are same, sir. Like for example, if it's the same standard for a lady cadet, the same standards have been applied for the male recruit also, sir. All right. And they are at par with the male recruits also here, sir. Okay. When you go back from here, sir, what memories are you going to take back? Because you'll go back to AD, sir. Again, computers, laptops, missiles, sir. So, what memories are you going to take back from here, sir? Assam Rifles has lived up to its name of friends of the Hiri people, sir. Not only being it is being utilized in water guarding role and along with the CI intensive environment, they have been helping the local people also, like people who have been located in the remotest of the part. Okay. They have been brought up to the mainstream. They have been held in uh, like internal security. Then the like uh, flights are there, sir, helping them to develop education. We have been helping them. So there are few things which you would want to go back in the unit, and you would like to help your families on the same lines also, sir. So Assam Rifles also has a soft face. Yes, sir. Right, sir. So Assam Rifles knows when to use the gun. Sir. It knows when to use the handshake. Winning of the heart. Winning, Winning of the hearts sir, and minds also. People, sir. That also you sir. do. Huh? Such a pleasure to meet sir. you, Captain Archana. Thank, Thank you, so you very much, much for being on sir. Patriot. Major SS Dadwal. Sir. Thank you for being on Patriot, my friend. My pleasure, sir. So, uh, tell me, what brings you to Assam Rifle? You got posted here how many years back? How many months back? Like, I put in two years of service in Assam Rifle, sir. Okay. I'm from inventory. Okay. So, I was posted here in... April 2016. Which regiment are you from? I am from Tujat Multan Regiment, sir. All right, Tujat Multan, sir. How is SM Rifles different from your infantry battalion, sir? So Tujat, purani paltan hogi na? Yes, sir. 200 years. 200 years back, sir. A 200 years purani paltan hai. You come from a very respected infantry battalion, and then you have come to SM Rifles, where it is different. The culture is different. The people are different, right? Tell me something about this, sir. The first and the foremost difference between a Sam rifle and a regular infantry battalion is, sir, here the troops are all India troops, like mix. You can find the people from Mizoram, Manipur, Rajasthan, Haryana, everywhere, every Everywhere. part of the Yes. Like, uh, what is not there in a regular infantry battalion? Like, mine is a Jat regiment. Pure Jat. I've got pure Jats. Achha. That is the first difference. Maybe Rajasthan, Haryana, wherever. UP. UP. Only three states. Yes, three states, but pure Jat. Pure Jat. Okay. The other difference is the kind of motivation these guys have got in a Sam rifle, sir. Yes. Because these people, they have to survive till 60 years in Northeast and totally CI environment. Yes. Infantry battalions, otherwise in army, sir, they have a tenure of two and a half year, three year in field and they go to peace. Yes. But here in Northeast, in Assam Rifle, there is no peace, sir. Hmm. They have to be in field throughout their life, sir. Throughout their careers. Throughout their careers. They retire at 60 years of age. Till the time you're here, till the time you sort of retire, you're doing nothing but CI, C CI. and border guarding, sir. That's all. That's all. And uh, feel, 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 feel throughout. Throughout their life. Right. So it requires a different kind of mindset to do all this, right? We have to prepare recruits according to that only. The training is based on that only, sir. Okay. Here I am doing a training officer, sir, of number okay. three training battalion. All right. We have to prepare those uh, recruits, those who are civilians, sir. We have to make them a soldier. Okay. The, the training is based on that only. So that they are ready for the task which has to be given to them for the next 30, 40 odd years. Okay. Till the time they are retired, sir. Excellent, excellent. So, uh, tell me something now. You are going to go back after some time. Sure. You will go back to your unit. And what memories are you going to take back from here? Memories. I'm sure there are many pleasant memories also. Yes, sir. Pleasant memories. The thing is, the kind of motivation I have seen in the troops of the Northeast, sir. Yes. It is amazing, sir. Excellent. Such a pleasure speaking to you, Major Dadwal. Thank you very much Thanks. for being on Patriot here. Bazaar.com Patriot powered by Amity University.